Hello, my name is Nigel Kiley. I'm a children's orthopaedic surgeon and I work at the Robert Jones and Agnes Hunt Orthopaedic Hospital in Oswestry. You've been asked to take your baby for a hip scan to decide if they have hip dysplasia. Not all newborn children are referred for a scan, but some are for the following reasons. Some babies who are born breech, which means born bottom or feet first. If a close relative, such as a mother, father, brother or sister, has had a hip problem as a child. If there are any concerns when your baby was examined at birth or by the GP. However, some children with hip dysplasia are normal when examined. A scan is the best way to diagnose hip dysplasia. Hip dysplasia is a condition where one or both hips can be shallow, uh, not fully lying in joint or dislocated. If left untreated, it can get worse and need surgery. The earlier we find that your baby has hip dysplasia means that the treatment will be easier and more likely to be successful. If found early, hip dysplasia can be treated with a splint and this is very often successful. Hip dysplasia does not cause pain as a baby. Hip dysplasia does not affect your baby's development, such as crawling or walking. The scan is an ultrasound scan like the scans done in pregnancy. Bring your normal baby clothes, change of nappy, dummy and a bottle for feeding. The scan is safe and does not cause pain or harm. Both hips are scanned even if only one hip is affected. The baby is undressed and lies on their side. Sometimes we'll put the baby into a cradle to support them. Gel is used and the scanner is put onto the side of the hip. You can comfort your baby or bottle feed them whilst the scan is being performed. Sometimes we can give your baby a sugary liquid to drink whilst we're doing the scan. The person performing the scan will tell you what they have found. If the first scan is normal, then no treatment is required and you'll be allowed to go home. If the scan is not normal, then your baby may need a further scan to see if the hip has improved with growth. Your baby may need treatment. Either this can be straight away or later if the hip has not developed properly. You may be referred to a specialist team who will advise on treatment. During treatment, further scans are arranged to make sure the hip is improving. In the first few weeks of life, a hip harness can be used. There are several different types available. Sometimes surgical treatment can be required. This will be discussed with you by an orthopaedic surgeon. 